in the basement of that home, that abandoned home I told you about. And in the daylight, in some of this video you're about to see, the framing of the structure is completely burnt down. The house was totally destroyed. We we're going to let it just collapse into the foundation and can be contained there, but we've got some that has gotten out into the woods. Jeff Duffy works for the Odin Ridge Fire Department. He was one of the first to arrive on scene to clear the hot spots this afternoon. We have got a uh, arson investigator uh, that's going to be here later to, uh, to look into this. They're already en route. Tanya Drillard lives next door. She says she's seen people walk in and out of the abandoned home from time to time, which has her wondering how it started. It's a rock house. So it was kind of like nobody's lived there for two or three years. So you're thinking, how is this possible? Firefighters believe the fire could have been started by someone not supposed to be there. For hours, fire crews from Eva and Odin Ridge Fire Departments have been clearing several hot spots. They tell me they were surprised by the amount of damage. This is a very thick wooded area, you know, and there's still hot spots. I keep hearing the sirens go off periodically, even after several hours of no activity and they're, it's still burning. Driller tells me in the last couple of years, they've seen an increase of theft and homes broken into. We've had a lot of uh, minor thefts, like uh, gas coming up missing, some people's had break-ins, so things like that. You hear a lot of activity in the woods. I mean, we are in the country. 